got a trailer to talk to, to have discuss. Tomb Raider finally dropped a full trailer. Now we did one on the teaser, right? And we had some good and bad things to say about that. It was up and down. Um, so this is the full trailer. Uh, what did you think about that teaser? Uh, I was. It's 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 been really interesting to like witness the uh, way they've rebooted Tomb Raider through mm -hmm. the uh, the two new games that they've made mm -hmm. and some of the newer comics that have come out. And I think they've actually managed to fix a lot of what's wrong. You talking like, in the game? In the game, mm -hmm. you know, with that character, yeah, you know, and actually made that character into what into the kind of like because uh, they've talked a lot of game on that character, and so mm -hmm. they finally like made her into more of a badass, you know. But also made her more believable and more human. <laughs> so it, it, it's nice to see them making a movie based off of this version of Tomb Raider. Right. Um, that trailer, the, the the teaser, it was cool. It was a lot of imagery from the game, um, which I'm seeing. It looks like it's gonna be like kind of like a big chase movie, mm -hmm. and which I'm cool with that. But my problem is, um, are you gonna take too much from the game? Yeah. And it's like. It's like you say, what well, it is based on the game. Why, why shouldn't you take it from the game? Because it ha it has to have something to keep you from just going and playing the game. Exactly, and and this and this, and this is my whole thing. You make these movies for people that don't like to play games, because some people you say that story is good. It deserves for people to see it, but people don't want to see a game, uh, cinematic or playthrough. Because some people ain't into games. But the story is good enough to hold up as a good narrative for a movie. So you say, well, let me make this uh, into a movie. Now, you're not just showing everything that's in the game, but you're kind of doing, you, you, you do stuff different enough yeah. that it can hold up as a movie. Like then you have to fill in the gaps that between where the cinematics would take off and where the gameplay takes yeah. off. So you have to tell the entire story instead, instead of the player telling it. Right, 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 right. So, so if you just give me the images from the game, that's not going to be good enough. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> so I don't mind they take some liberties and change some things. Well, like, the, the, the great thing about it is that, like, the minutia aren't really important. Mm -hmm. You know? Like, especially the way they structured that game. It's like, it's not about what happens. It's about how the character interacts with what's happening around them and mm -hmm. how they're changed by those events. Right, right, right. And then it's saying, like, if you know you know what's the result going to be, but the thing is how to get to that. Right. You know? So, <clears throat> um, so we're going to check out this trailer, and we're going to have a little discussion for it, uh, see how much how different it is from the original um, I mean, from the, I'm sorry, from the uh, teaser. So without further ado, uh, Tomb Raider Trap. There we go. I thought I saw that again. <laughs> I'm going mad. Lara, your father's gone. At some point, we have to face up to who we are. Who we're meant to be. I think I know where my dad went. That's right in the middle of the Devil's Sea. It will be an adventure. Death is not an adventure. Okay. <laughs> what are you doing here, Laura? Seven years I've been on this island. Your father, he put me here. Now I see the likeness. Intelligence. The recklessness. What do you know about my father? Laura, there was more to my life than boardrooms and business deals. There's an organization. That Destiny Child. It's looking to start a global genocide. Your dad sure you had a bigger holiday. Walter Goggins is the main villain. <laughs> Must stop them, Laura. Promise me. Go! Really? I'm a survivor. Ladies first. I'm not gonna give up. Open the tomb! Your finger is pulling this 
trigger. You messed with the wrong family. All right. All right, we back. <clears throat> we back. We just watched um we just watched Tomb Raider uh official trailer. What you think of that, bro? Uh, I mean, it's got us uh, it's definitely got the same feel as the game, but they've mm -hmm. definitely gone in their own direction with it. Mm -hmm. Uh definitely uh, uh I mean, it's her trying to figure out what happened what her father was getting into. Right. She got on a boat. Got lost in a storm, ended up on an, on an island. That's all the stuff that they took from the game. Yeah. Besides, like the look and feel of it, so they've got their own whole story, their own characters, and everything. Mm -hmm. So that's cool. But um, I'm not sure about that antagonist. Oh, uh, Walter Goggins. <laughs> hey, let's see what he if he can be actually taken seriously as a villain. Like that's the thing. Like if he can if he can like bring it and commit and make that authentic, then more power to him. Where he always because he got a Weasley look. Yeah, he's always playing either if if he if if he is a good guy or a bad guy, but he's always playing the Weasley person yeah. on there, and. But he's got the talent. Yeah. I, I want to see what he can do with that. On, I mean, on he, that, <laughs> he, he's a good actor, man. I, That's why I, I said can't knock his skill. I want to see what they do with it because I mean, on a, on a, on this trailer, looked like he was just being serious. He yeah. wasn't, you know, he didn't play up to the Weasley side of him. Or whatever. And so I'm hoping that 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 you know that holds yeah. throughout this movie. Well, well, what I'm gonna say about this trailer, it looked it actually looked pretty good. Um, I was. Um, I was kind of worried when I I heard that they used a little sample from uh, the Destiny Child Survivor, yeah. and I thought, oh, that sounds so stupid. But it kind of worked for me when I was watching this trailer. <laughs> I was feeling that just like the way they cut it to how you know I'm a, I like I ain't, I'm a survivor. You know the lyrics. I'm a survivor. I'm not gonna give up. I mean thematically, it, it tracks. It, it, it kind of worked because I was I was sort of feeling feeling her like if I, if I put myself in that situation. I ain't gonna say I'm, that song gonna be ringing through my head, <laughs> but those words are true. You know, right. like I'm not gonna let these motherfuckers beat me. You know, right. I'm a survivor. Like if, if you need a mantra in that situation, Destiny Child got you. <laughs> so I mean, I actually I I didn't think I was gonna like the song, but I kind of <laughs> liked it. And uh, but you know what? Unless she got Wolverine healing factor. Come on, man! I mean, Some of those, and, and that's the thing, like, because that's one of the main, one of the uh, major, like, uh, cri critiques against the game itself is yeah. they beat this girl's ass in that game. I, that's what you I'm know. saying. It's like when she hit that one tree, man, her bones should have been shattered, dude. Yeah. And then yeah. what? Let me guess. You gonna grab another tree and your arm would have been yanked out of socket? Yeah. Like, come on, man! I know y'all yeah. trying to. Mimic the game, but you got to make it realistic. Let me believe that she can still walk away from that injury. You mm -hmm. can't give me an injury where you might live, but you, you're not going to be running five minutes later like, oh, yeah. shit, that hurt. Well, let me keep on running. No. <laughs> like, I don't know if you noticed, but there's a tree branch sticking out of your thigh. Man, <laughs> you should probably get that looked at. <laughs> Man, dude. Well, that, that part when the point when she hit that tree, like yeah. bam, she flipped over. I'm like, oh shit! So like, cause her shit is toast. Cause like the thing <laughs> to me is like, I'm I'm seeing that scene, and like the, some of the uh, quick time events, like where she gets thrown off of something, and you gotta press the right button to keep her from falling into yeah, the yeah, 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 yeah. That looked like one of those scenes, scenes where you actually didn't press the button. <laughs> you didn't press the button, and she ends up dying. Yeah, like, right. Like, she like you're supposed to grab the thing and swing across. Yeah, and she falls down. Right, right, right. You, you miss that button, and you see, damn, you see her dramatic death. That was the death scene yeah. right there. What the yeah. fuck? That was the Reset death that. Why you put the death scene in there? Like, yeah. <laughs> see, they try to be, you know, a shock. Like, oh, this is this is gonna be the hardest thing she ever done. It's a shock value. Like, cause but no, she should be dead after look, that shit. Maybe if they didn't show her head snapping back so hard, <laughs> yeah. but, but like she was, they try to be too realistic. Yeah, y'all look too realistic. She should be dead. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was someone else. That, <laughs> that's how she knows not to fuck up. I'll tell you what. One thing I did, I'm happy they didn't do, because I remember in the teaser, they start off with a father with the record. If you're reading this, if you're seeing this, I'm already dead. <laughs> I hate things that start off with that shit, man. It's like, don't, only people get away with that is Mission Impossible. You know what I'm saying? Um, if you're, if you're, Listen to this tape. 
I'm dead. <laughs> like, oh my God, stop, stop right there, stop, just stop. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so no, it it looked cool, man. Um, but I'm telling you what, that first leap she did off the boat or whatever, yeah. what the fuck? Like seriously, unless she fucking got superpowers, you can't jump that damn far. Um, unless, oh let, me, oh, let me guess, the boat. Was rocking and it pushed her, it propelled I mean, her up. The, I mean, if the sea was if the sea was turbulent enough, the boat might have tossed her over. That might not have been a jump. Listen, listen to this motherfucker. <laughs> so, you the first motherfucker to point out fake shit. You gonna give them? You gonna give them a slide on that? Really? I'm just saying, man. Like, I, I got you. I, I, no, because like the thing is, I'm trying to rationalize. No, because I want to know what their bullshit excuse for how she managed that jump is. Yeah, well, for as I seen on the trailer, they got her jumping like. She's flying. Like, she's clearly on a wire, man. Like, Well, we know that, but I'm just saying. No, I mean, like, even, like, there, there's, if you could. In the believability of that universe, what are y'all trying to get me to believe? That right. she actually made that jump? You know, like, because <laughs> with the game, there's a lot of those moments where you're saying, that, how did she make? Oh, she didn't. Like, the point of it was she didn't know better than to not, not try to make that jump, you know. I think it's more like what you said, the fucking boat, the current of the boat was yeah. going so, and she was already in the middle of a jump, so it propelled her even farther. You know, like, I mean, the only thing I can come up with. If a boat did throw anybody like that, there would be no getting your form right. It would be you were on the boat, and now you're in the middle of the air. <laughs> yeah, I mean, okay. Equivalent to um, – Riding on a motorcycle and it and it just stops. Yeah. <laughs> you are gonna be flying. So I don't know. It look. It look. It looks. It looks uh, entertaining though. It yeah. looks like nobody could live through that shit though. It's no. just a little too much. That's my only problem was like y'all trying to. And this is in one day, so no time to heal. Right. You know what I'm saying? And you mean no way she could fall like that and, and no broken bones. You know, it's not like she. This is gonna take a month. Yeah, it ain't like she get hurt this day and come back. A month later, and then get her right, again. Right. No, this all when she hurt and fall up and hurt herself, she got to keep going. Like she's taking hits that that take that put people out of work in the NFL. Yeah, <laughs> yes. Yeah. And she's what ninety nine pounds. She's ninety nine pounds, <laughs> no pads. Yeah, no, no protection. Ninety nine like, pounds. She ain't even got pads in a bra. Okay, <laughs> so she taking mad hits. Yeah, and and then she gets right back up and gets right back to running. So. I <laughs> They should, nah. you know what? They they should retcon it and say like she um, got some kind of healing factor. Let's give her a healing factor. Yeah, I mean I'm yeah. cool with that. Everybody be like, women, women, that's fake. It's all fake, bro. <laughs> if you set it up, it's it's pl- it's believable. You know what I'm saying? She, like this girl just just swung on a uh, on a vine over a waterfall, <laughs> caught herself on the opposite side with a climbing axe. One would be snatched clean yeah. the fuck off. Right. Like, <laughs> Like it, or like when she was going down the water and she caught onto that plane, that rusty ass plane with all sharp shit look, sticking out. You need taking a shot just she, looking at that shit. Not only was she need a <laughs> shot, she need new fingers. <laughs> so you mean tell me that rusty ass plane with all sharp stuff did not cut her? Not a bit. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, come on, okay. You know what? She just lucky. So let's give her that. She's lucky. She got luck powers. So yeah, okay. that she got the power of luck. She got a healing factor, yep. and she can jump super far. <laughs> not fly jump yeah good. jump jump she can jump she can't fly <laughs> but it's okay even if she jump for her and she lands somewhere that it normally breaks somebody legs Yo, she'd she be fine yeah, she, yeah straighten she, it out she'd be fine <laughs> <laughs> no broken bones no uh no acl tears no, you know no shit like no, that you know what it is she got fast and furious powers yeah, that's it. Yeah, Van yeah. Diesel probably loaned her his power. Right. So, yeah. You know, he just uh, wait. Look, he just she got the diesel real quick. Yeah, she got the Van Diesel powers. <laughs> <laughs> but no, uh, seriously though, it it's, it looked like it's gonna be entertaining. It looked like hope, a fun ride. I hope this be the best video game movie of all time. I don't know. Assassin's Fist is hard to beat. Assassin. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But see. The best Hollywood. I was about to say mainstream. Yeah. Mainstream, because that was a web movie. All right. But um all the fan stuff is always kind of legit in some way. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, this 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 is on this is, you know, on track to if 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 everything goes well, to be the best Hollywood video game movie ever. Yeah, we'll see. Oh, I was about to say she didn't have a um her um two guns, but I remember in the game she didn't get that. Until later on. Until was it the end of the game or not quite the end, but 
close to it. Yeah. So that's fine. So we'll see. And and I bet you're gonna have an animal attack too because they were part of the game. Yeah. <laughs> That'll just be too it, much. No, you know that the bear attack. <laughs> Well, you get the bears, atta- then they have wolves attack you, yeah. and you can't even see the wolves because it'd be dark, and then yeah. these black wolves come out the dark. And, and they just be swarming you doing hit and run tactics. I know. <laughs> Goodness. I never thought I would hate wolves so much. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that's our discussion for um, Tomb Raider, the movie. Uh, when is it coming out? Like in this, this spring or something? Something like that, yeah. Yeah, it's coming out soon this year. We're going to get a review on it. It look it look kind of it look alright it looks pretty good I ain't gonna lie I I was I got into it yeah. I even got into them playing the Destiny Child song <laughs> <laughs> didn't think I was gonna get into it but I, you took a small sip of the Kool Aid <laughs> I kind of liked it I kind of liked it I ain't gonna lie so uh, that's our that's our uh, discussion on the Tomb Raider trailer not bad not bad <laughs> so moving on. Uh-huh.